The countdown is on. Will or won't President Biden forgive student loan debt? A decision is expected soon, but Joe St. George is tracking whether this idea is really as popular as some say it is. Oh, the 1980s, the era of Ronald Reagan, Michael Jackson, and yes, the Sony Walkman. Speaking of the 80s, it's hard to believe how cheap going to college was back then. In 1988, if we adjust for inflation, the average yearly cost of tuition at a public college was around $3,100. Last year, it was over 10 grand. Private universities are close to four times more. No wonder the typical college debt in this country among borrowers is around $30,000, which brings us to a popular debate happening in offices and cubicles around this country. Should President Biden cancel some of it? I am considering dealing with some debt reduction. The president is currently, after years of saying he would never forgive debt with an executive order, seriously considering some cancellation. According to the White House, the exact amount of forgiveness being considered is unclear. The currently talked about plan includes forgiveness applying to those making $125,000 a year, although that number may change. The president said he's expected to announce his decision in a few weeks. Here in Washington, a lot of progressives say debt forgiveness will be popular and that it will help a lot of people. While that is true, it's also true that a lot of people will not benefit from the policy and that plenty of uncertainty will exist if it happens. According to data from the Federal Reserve, if 10 people are in a room, four will have gone to college. That means six never got a degree. How will they feel about this use of taxpayer resources? Not to mention a recent survey found 47% of Americans who had student debt at one point had completely paid off their loans. President Biden's plan is not expected to include any back pay for those that have already finished their payments. I took out 20 grand for this first year. Of course, when you chat with those currently in school, like I did recently, you realize how much of a burden all this debt is. Patrick Milkey worries about life post law school. It is kind of a worry that if I get out, will I make enough money to pay those loans back? Even if the president does take action, that will not be the end of this debate. Critics are expected to sue the president over his authority, which means years of student loan uncertainty may be on the horizon. In Washington, I'm Joe St.